Hello everyone, so in this video I will be reviewing 2022 complete Python bootcamp from zero to hero in Python by Josh. So this course is available in Udemy in something around eight or nine dollars. So yeah, it is very cheap course to buy. So uh, I will be reviewing this. So we will be reviewing this course in basically three section. First the introduction of the course, what it covers then the advantages and the disadvantages of the course okay i will be covering all the aspects so let's let us start with the introduction of the course so basically the course covers the basic things about the python and all about the python programming language so one thing which i want to clear you if you are a complete beginner if you are a complete beginner this is your first first language you are learning first language is python which you want to learn through this course then yeah this course is okay for you this course is perfect for you because this is very beginner friendly or you can purchase this course if you if you are learning python at the first time or python is your first language which you want to learn so you can definitely purchase this course because this is really beginner friendly and all the topics are covered from very very scratch okay so the course starts from the python setup okay then the basic things about the python like object and data structures basics comparison operator statements methods and function then here is milestone one project then object oriented programming so one thing which i want to tell you about object oriented programming yeah the basic things are covered in this course but to understand a uh, depth about object oriented programming because this is really an important topic the section is not enough i think you should you should learn object oriented pro pro programming after this course from the external sources also like geeks for geeks because i think this section is not enough uh, i know the all the basic things are covered but you must know uh, more concepts and more practice you will need it after this okay then the modules and packages error and exception handling then here is milestone project 2 and after it this is some advanced topic like decoders generators then the advanced python modules then web scrapping with python okay this section is really good which i like in this course because web scrapping means you are scrapping the data from the websites okay so this section uh, section is really good then you will finding working with the pdf spreadsheet and emails with python so okay so now let me talk about the advantages so this is super beginner friendly first thing is super beginner friendly then the second thing is like all the topics which is need, needed for basic understanding of the language is covered okay so no topic is left for the basic understanding i think all the topics are covered in the course second thing is yeah if you only need to work with the python language then this is okay this is okay means you do not want to extend something like web development or because all these things are not covered in the course only you want to basic understand the python language then this course is okay then the basic uh, yeah this is beginner friendly and basic understanding is also okay the object oriented section i found is little less you should practice it from the external sources everything is fine then okay and then the advanced things and some capstone python project okay so these are all only the advantages and i can say that teaching is very good and nothing extra this is all about the course but now i will come to let you know about the disadvantages of the course so i found that all the things which is covered in this course is easily available free on youtube so you can also cover these things from the youtube because there is nothing as X factor in this course that you should purchase this course. If you want a paid course to maintain just the discipline thing, you can buy this course. But I will suggest you, you can look out the Corey Scherfer's Python list, Python playlist. Okay. Which is also similar and cover all the contents which is men mentioned in this course okay so you can also cover all the basics and things from this playlist also because uh, i found nothing uh, x factor in this course like something extraordinary or you will be covering any miscellaneous topic or very good projects so not nothing like like that this is, this is just the basic python 
and you will be learning the basic python from basic to advanced which you can also co cover from the various youtube resources so this is the disadvantage which i which i think of otherwise the teaching is very good no issues with that but yeah now youtube is very vast and you can cover these things from youtube also but if you want a paid course then you can definitely purchase this course okay so uh, this is all about the review of this course so it is up to you you want to purchase it or not otherwise it is very beginner friendly and you can see all the topics are covered no issue with that so thank you